it's no longer the best defense ever. Ever since it stopped being a gold golem, its uh, defense is not as crazy. No, oh, I'm going to breed it. Twin hits is all I need. Alright, this Duran. Where is it? There it is. And this Darkhorn. are about to make something truly awesome. This thing needs to be the opposite gender of my Saito, I think. Right? Titanus breeds with... Yeah, Saito. It's male. I think that my Saito is male, yeah. Alright, I've never even seen this monster before, so it's going to blow my mind whatever is inside it. I could look at it right now. Let's wait till it hatches. The temptation to look at it was so insanely high. This is Snake. Also, sorry, Randy, you got bred away. That is apparently a Titanus. It has super, super, super stupid stats for a level 1. Plus 17, I've gone a long way. Alright, so you're about to kick ass and take names right now. I told you, fucking, I'm doing a lot of breeding. This thing's stat ups are good, but not great. But its initial stats are so good. This top spell is useless. It's actually a material. It's not even a boss yet. No wonder. Oh shit, it has it! It has blazer eyes hair bang! It's another one. It's another one. This thing's gonna have Big Bang too. This is already a really good mon. I'm gonna train it till it learns twin hits. I mean by attack. No, I mean twin hits. The skills have really similar names. Drag slap. What the fuck? Psych up is useless. You have to learn three more like skills that are. I need sleep all. More skills, Wind Beast, better than Bird Blow. Berserker? I don't know what that is. I think I've seen that one before. Dark Horn, though. Green Slash. That's good. Uh, Guardian is no longer imperative. No longer imperative. Every time Bath levels up, I feel a magic back? That's rare. I'm not going to learn it, though. I wonder what the max level of all these mons is. It's probably 99 for all of them. Because they're all super high. Yeah, 13, 12, and 17. I just want to look that up. Twin 
twin hits, there it is, level 17 on the dot. Stop spell is non-essential. Song across kind of do kill streams. I've noticed. I haven't. I didn't even think about that. But like, really, a lot of streams I used to watch were like hmm. they did song request, and um, it's not as fun to be in there. That's the one I have to do. I really want like just crazy XP. I'm gonna look up Game Shark codes this game. Because I want this thing to be the best thing ever. Um, game facts. Should have it. Oh. It doesn't. That's annoying because I don't know if the. Hold on. I got a little distracted with this because I had a bunch of stuff I didn't know about. This guy wrote like a fucking... I want to get XP. Yes! 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 EXP and money! There we go. Damn. I said something pretty similar recently. You can listen to your own music while watching a stream, and that way, everyone will, um, you'll hear exactly the song you want to listen to without subjecting everyone else to it. make like a, a super backup save state. We're going to make a save state that trumps all save states. We're going to write in state 2. We're going to go to, we're going to turn off disable cheats. We're going to go to the cheat list. We're going to add a game shark cheat 
for exp and now we're gonna go have a battle with a slime whoa we got an error code and the visual boy and fans is frozen and it's no longer got a game open well let's try that again maybe I used a little bit too high of a number wait should I have done that? no I want to load state too Oh shit, I lost the game shark codes. Wait, is this right? Is it 18, 19, 19? Oh, I fucked it up. It's a 10101. Oh wait, hold on. That's right. A 186. Wait, god damn it. Gotta check these numbers. A 180, 96, 98. There we go. 6 BDA, 6 CDA, 6 DDA. I'm going to disable these codes until after I get into the fight. Actually, I'm going to load state 2, and I'm going to have disable cheats, and then I'm going to add them. This is completely harmless. Now we're gonna go to pirate. We're gonna enter the battle and we're gonna turn off the cheat. Oh! That still didn't work. Looks like a really solid game. It's me cheating. That's the reason it's kind of work. It's kind of funky. All right, I'm gonna turn off the cheat and then turn it back on. I mean, turn off, turn on the cheat. Okay, that did nothing. All right, so I'm beginning to wonder if I'm in the wrong thread. Let's add a more modest number. Let's change them all to 66. I change them all to 40. I did not add the new ones. Why is it only let me remove one at a time? Alright. Let's try our luck. That reset the game and changed the color palette. Alright, I'm messing with some codes that need not messed with. I need a better I need a better code because this one's not cutting it. That was pretty cool though. Dynam slot modifier, infinite max tiny metals to give to the metal man. Max experience. Yee, this is this is like the Kobe's journey code. Tar's adventure, a completely different one.
The item slot modifier codes are super useful. Once the monster was defeated, line is displayed. Those bytes used to calculate EXP earned. So I have to activate it during the... Alright, let's try that actually. That actually sounds like worth an attempt. Oh, there we go. It worked. Let's disable it again. I got Surge. Yo, we in there. We in there. Got the code to work. Oh god, what's this guy's max level? I'm scared. I'm scared. I should have been doing this sooner. Whoa, he got Hellblast. That's in his code? How long has he had that? I'm... Oh, it's because of Thordain and Lightning. Now he has Thorday and now he has Lightning. The combination of them gives you Hellblast. I don't need Bee Dragon. I like Rock Throw because it doesn't cost that much MP and it does good damage. I should have just leveled everything in my farm to almost max level. I did this right at the end of my Dragon Quest 3 playthrough. never gonna stop. I got Hellblast on this guy too. Why? He doesn't have the necessary... Oh, is it because of... Wait, that one might have just had Hellblast. One of them might just have Hellblast. I don't need Rain Slash. Rain Slash is gay. Big Bang from the skills it knows. There we go. White Fire, White Air, and Explode A all result in Big Bang. Got Ultra Down on this guy, too. All of his skills are already good. Should get rid of Fire Slash and Ice Slash. I can't wait to see their stats. Holy fuck. I'm like getting freaked out thinking about it. These are like bosses, and they still got that much XP. Those are all pretty good. Uh, these two capped MP. Besides that, they're all like, none of them hit max level. Their skills are fucking stupid good. Well, how much damage am I doing per hit? Pops attacks, 366. That's pretty powerful. Um, I'm going to do that one more time.
There we go. Damn it. Damn it. Instinct. Max level 99. Increase the limit of its growth. Yup. 99. Snake should actually learn a new skill. Because Snake has all the requirements of Big Bang. He should learn it once he gets to a certain level or a certain stat. I think his int is just kind of lagging. His int is not very high. He might not have he not he might not ever have the int to use Big Bang, which makes me really sad because he has all the requirements besides that. He's getting real close without learning it. I'm just hoping it'll get up high enough. Nope. Nope. Never learned it. Nope. It's he's pretty far off still. You need at least six hundred some int. I could just, no, I can't even level him up anymore, so he can't learn it. I just have to make his kid learn it, which should be really easy. So, I'm going to have the most awesome baby in the entire world right now. Well, before I do anything else, I'm going to have an arena battle. Because this is as good as my team will ever be. Might as well do the highest level at the arena. Wow, those are pretty rad mons. That was a Whale Mage, a Rainhawk, and a Divine Gone. Whale Mage, Rainhawk, and a Mad Cat. Horn Beat, uh, Medusa Eye. Well, I got money. I actually made a lot of money doing that. I could use that to farm money. I didn't make a lot. I made a thousand. It's not a lot. So these are randomly generated. Whoa, a gold slime. All right, I killed it. Freaked me out for a second there. Attack seed and a meteorb. Smart book. Odd belt. Magic key. So you can just farm magic keys, I guess, doing that. Let's use the code for infinite money. Mm. Once I cheat a little bit, I get like I get to a point where it's just like I don't feel bad about cheating anymore. Let's breed. Wait, no, this I want to do that final region. Lonely. I walk this lonely road. It's the only road I've ever known. Don't know where it goes, but it's home to me. And I walk alone. Yeah. Yeah. You guys know that song? Was that Hellblast? I think it was. I like, want to see the fucking amazing casts my monsters are doing right now. Attacked. I mean, honestly, they should just be attacking. That was how last I saw it. Here's a Robuster. I've like ruined it. Shadow. I guess I gotta tell a guy about it. Be nice if I had an exit bell. I think I do actually. Right, I just got the fucking okay to kill him. There's a there was a very sad scene 
in Dragon Warrior 7 that's kind of like this, but much more sad. It was actually, like, really sad. So now I should have the ability to... Um, yeah. Robosir stopped moving. What is the Wiz Stone? There's a world doing there I could have taken to. My farm should be super high level as well. That's the really good, nice thing. I got a smart book for that. Oh, that's right. You can breed a Robuster. This is your clue. If you breed two Robusters and then breed, they you get it like at least plus five and breed them together. You can breed a Robuster too. So that's like I guess this world is like your clue in that you can breed a Robuster too. I guess. I right, still got a lot of breeding to do. Sido and Tightness. Um. No profound reason not to hatch it. Genocido. This is going to be Baffy. And he's going to be my BFF. This thing is going to be the best thing ever. It's like the same face! Thanks, Toriyama. Toriyama can only draw one face on monsters, too. Those are some pretty rad stats for a level 1. I like how I've been previously saying that on monsters that had, like, level... That had like like over a hundred in their stats at level one, but this thing has like over four hundred. Also, Snake, you're dead. You've been bred away. Hi, Befa. I'm pretty sure a lot of this stuff is just max level. A lot of it. Whoa, fucking the king, the metal king, I bred. It's that high of a level. This guy's super high. I'm probably going to stream it on Hitbox if I ever stream it. I got a god to max level legit. What's my current plan? I got the Genocido, which I didn't even need. Argon, White King and Metal King. I gotta get a new White King. Don't tell me that guy won't be impressed with my existing monster. I'm pretty sure he needs a Grand Slime. He's like up here. Oh, okay. That actually worked. I got the baffle key. I wonder which one he was impressed with. I think I brought this one in already. Wait, what? Oh, overcome the key that doesn't exist in this world. So there's uh, keys. You have to get the other key from him in Kobe's journey. And then there's a third key. I hate shit like that, dude. Like the fucking Reggie's. Alright, let's see what's in that third world. This region also promises to be very small. I'm paying attention to... Oh, pay attention to my... Ste Are you gifting me something, dude? You better not give me something. Whoa. What just happened? What just happened? Also, I just went back kind of far. I didn't go back that far. But that's annoying. I just hadn't been making save states. I think I got... Um, I think I got... Uh, 
What did I get? I think I got. I think he cast beat on me or something. My notifications are on. I'll check my Steam in a second. Quieted Pops? What the fuck does that mean? I've never seen that. He sure is getting a lot of MP per level. His other stats aren't even that good. Oh yeah, hold on. I never got any of these. Smart hat. I need room. <laughs> okay, about an herb. I like sand is okay. I want that cleric ring. Monsters that steal your power. Overconfidence is a trap. No, there's no such thing as overconfidence right now. These things are really high level. Monsters that use dangerous skills. Merm scale. Thief ring, I want that. Love water. The next bath cup is on Thursday. Every bath cup is on Thursday. Yikes. Well, I won anyway. No, I want to win with Baffy not dying. There we go. Herb, gold cape, antidote, mage ring. There was nothing overwhelmingly good here, and that kind of disappoints me. I thought there would be like something really crazy. I won with two mons, I just realized that. So is this area done? Yeah. I've got to figure out how to get the other key. That way I can get the third key. Everything results in a genocido. What am I doing right now? Gotta get a White King. Gotta get a White King. I'm like overwhelmed from the sheer amount of ass I just kicked. Skullgon plus King Slime. Or Skullgon plus Andriel. They both work.
Oh. If your inventory's full, then you'll get 6,000 regardless of which one you win. So you can make up to 5,000 in a single go. I could get a bunch of darks using tiny metal cheats. That would actually be really good. That would be amazingly helpful because I'd be able to breed all the boss stuff. And if I had a bunch of boss stuff just off the off the right off the bat, um, like if I got a dark right now, for example, uh, dark plus a uh, devil is I mean a zombie is a white king, or a, zo a zombie plus a dark rather. Dark is actually not used anywhere in the final breeding. Oh, breeding another side, I won't even be that hard. Because I can just use a dark egg to get a rose vine. So I just need to breed the Jamoris. I'm still a little, over little overwhelmed with all the work I still have to do. Oh well. Won't get done till I do it. Do I need two Zomas? I do need two Zomas. Wait, no, I can use a mirror dress. So I can breed my only Zoma into an Ashira Zoma. I don't need to make a new one. Ah, god damn it. It's harder than I realized, though. Damn it. I do need two Zomas. Uh, so it was one of the requirements for Saito. There must be another way. No, the only other way is Mirror Dress. I could read two Mirror Dresses, but that requires two Gold Slimes. What happens if I breed a boss plus a slime? What's the result? King Slime. That's shitty. There must be a better way to get a gold slime. Two metal kings. Oh my god. There's still so much. Gold Golem is one of the ways. But every Gold Golem requires a bunch of uh, King Slime? No. Yes. No, Metal Drax. Bunch of Metal Drax. Two Metal Drax. I think the easiest way is going through Metal Kings. Yeah. A King Slime plus a Metal Drax is a Metal King. Then every two Metal Kings I get, I get a, a Gold Slime. And I need one... Two, three gold slimes. Four. Four gold slimes. So I need four more king slimes and four metal dracks. But metal drac is really easy to get. That's just four andrials. And four uh, of any material. And I have an entire world of material monsters. It would be so easy if I had wonder eggs, because you can just read repeated wonder eggs. This is ridiculous. I haven't done anything. I'm paralyzed. Alright, material plus andriel.
what's my current material situation? I've got a mad mirror. I've got a brush head and a facer and a spiky boy. I've got three materials. Just breed some of them. And an evil wand. That's four. Female, male, male, female. So I need four andrials of two different genders. Let's go make some money really fast in the arena. Let's see if this is indeed true. Yep, you get 6,000. It was true. That is easy money. I get three sirloins every time I do this. I've never seen a lot of these monsters. I've never fully explored the fish region. Or the fish, why did I say fish region? Alright, I'm making hella money now. Alright, I'm loaded. I have to ditch some of my items and buy a bunch of sirloins. Don't care about a smart book. I have a sirloin. I have several. I just have the one. Don't care about... The Volt Staff. Don't care about Love Water. I don't care about my five ribs. I'm gonna go deposit some of the items I'm holding. Damn it, I put away a world loot. Fuck! Damn it. I hate this. It's just slow enough that it's irritating me. Alright, whatever. Give me sirloins or give me death. Now, how am I looking for tiny metals? I don't even have enough for a single dark. I can't even think of any areas that I haven't explored yet, but supposedly there's still a lot left. There's supposedly about 16 or 17 tiny metals in the main game. Hmm. <sighs> Some of them by the mid time unlock. Why? Hey. Why? Hey. So I have a bunch of materials. Let's catch a bunch of andrials. I need four andrials. Two of each gender. Andrew female. I think I just unleashed quad hits.
Join, asshole. I know I already have an Andrew. Andrew female. Now I need two male ones. That's annoying because the whoa, too far back. The male ones are apparently harder to get. Andrew female. There you go. Now it begins. And of course, I've been two skills. I don't even know if this is like a fucking Andrew I want. Andrew female, it's not. For some bizarre reason, every single every single Andrew female I find is is every single Andrew like solo I find is female. Like always. Oops. And drill female. This is just how this works. I only find. Oh, it's the same battle. What am I doing? I only find female and drills. I only find female gizmos. This battle should be good. Because I should be able to. They might be different. There we go. Different genders. Alright, let's get some breeding going right now. I'll breed two of them. Then I need another Andrew male. I need four gold slimes, right? That's right. Two gold slimes for a grand slime. One gold slime for one thing, one gold slime for another thing. I think that's it. Metal Drac and King Slime. Yeah. So the Metal Drac's genders don't matter. Two metal drags. Need one more Andriel. Now I need to start catching slimes. Need a king slime of the opposite gender of both of these, so I need a king slime of both genders right now. Please have a vagina. Oh shit, I fucked up. I fucked up. Oh god. I have fucked up. Please, please join and please be male. Please. He didn't join. I forgot. I forgot these guys were itching to grow a bunch of levels. It's so slow, they're growing three levels each. Oh, I got the Mime Slime. I want that. Do they have fucking treads? That's what it looks like on their model. Come on. 
I need a male Andriel. I think I just need the one battle where there's two Andriels. I think that's the only way. Here we go. Whoa, they both died. That's actually fine. That would have been perfect. Andriel male. Got it. I need a king slime of both genders. The mime slime can be made into a halo slime, which I don't know what that is. That level, that kill is fine. They both died. Excellent. All right, give me a king slime or give me death. There we go. That's two. Are you serious? Thordane doesn't kill the fireweed. King slime male. Now I need a king slime female. I actually need a bunch of king slimes. I need king slimes until I can't hold anymore. Why can the fucking that thing take a king slime male? That's still fine. I need a king slime female though. There we go. All right, we got a lot of breeding we can do. This is actually pretty easy. I'm surprised. It's really, really easy to breed. Uh, Gold slime. It's a lot of breeding, but it's all the monsters are readily accessible. Which I didn't think about. Metal track plus king slime? No. Metal king. Do not hatch. Breed this metal track with this. Um, no, I gotta start with the king slime. Do not hatch. And then I've still got my male king slime. So I need to hatch a female. Is that a vampirus? That's rare, isn't it? Caught the male Andriel. What was I gonna breed it with? I had like a female material, this thing. So what's this thing need to be? Female. Wait, does it need to be female? It needs to breed with the male king slime, yeah. Okay. So that actually worked out. I have to get this thing kind of... I need to get it to level 10. Alright, I got it to level 10 in one battle. Yeah, this is going much faster than I thought. But again, this is only a small part of the total breeding I have left. Metal Drac. It's King Slime, then Metal Drac. Shouldn't matter if I hatch it. It's male. And then my other metal king, a lot of king monsters, is also male. So the remaining two need to be female. I just hatched a male one. This one's female. Metal kings are so cute, and I like that I have two of them. These things have really crazy skills. I never hatched that whale mage. <laughs> I like bred it and I was just like, oh. 
Um, there's no reason not to hatch the Metal King. Alright, I'm gonna get so much experience here that the one... oh shit, I wanna go to Limbo. The one back there will get to level 10. Damn, these things have weird stats. 0 HP, 19 MP, 4 attack. It's all just in fucking defense and agility. They're uh, they're not even their magic is that good. Also, they have very lo uh, slow leveling. Which saddens me. They have different skills, which I find strange, because I thought I made them out of the same shit. Quickly go check the other one and recruit it, since the others are all level 10. All this for a fucking Grand Slime. Grand Slime looks pretty badass. Of all the slimes I've seen, it's one of my favorites. It's not number one. Of all the souls I've encountered in my travels, his was the most human. Why on earth did I ever decide I wanted to play this game, let alone fucking fully beat it? Two Metal Kings is indeed what I want to do. Hatching it is fine. Gold Slime, it's female. This one has to be male. It is. So King Slimes are actually kind of Jewel Slime, which means they actually fucking funnel down at the back. Innocent and female, of course. Of course. Affable and male, innocent and female. These things have pretty stupid stats. HP is not so good. Again, these are among the immune to everything monsters. So actually, I miscalculated. All the monsters I just caught bred me two gold slimes, which equals one grand slime. I still need another Metal King. I need one of these grand gold slimes to make a mirror dress. I need a grand slime to make a dark dream. No, I don't. Because I can use the Ashurazoma. But I want to make a grand slime anyway. Fuck. It's the second time that's happened. If I ever manage to get Orgotomir, I'm going to cry. So, all the breeding I just did to get a Grand Slime was not in vain, because I do need it. They just learned Chance. Chance is a really weird skill. 
they can do stuff. Best possible description. Alright, I'm going to breed these two. I have no profound attraction to what they make. So this is a profound moment. This is what you get when you actually breed two gold. I've actually bred one of these before. On my own. There you go. There's a grand slime. It's got a pretty cool design in my opinion. It feels like a very powerful slime. I wish it was blue though. I wish it had the like the fundamental slime color. This is one of the rarest monsters in the game though. Let's go look up what its unique skills are. And gold slimes too, because I'm sure they're also really cool. Grand slime is four stars for Ernest. Informer, farewell, and focus. I don't care about any of those. Gold slime is three and a half. Chance, big bang, and surge. Bolt, iron eyes, and hellblast. See, this one, this this one has this used to be like the rarest slime. So it, it having bolt, iron eyes, and hellblast were like three super hard to get skills. And then like big bang and s big bang is still really hard to get, but chance and surge are well, chance is rare, but not necessarily good and surge is neither rare nor good it's kind of good and then all of these are kind of farewell is very un uh, uncommon I think very few monsters naturally learn that but focus don't give a fuck what the fuck is ah what kind of skill name is that I like a fucking regular ass slime has mega magic, which it can never ever learn. Oh yeah, how many total do I have? I'd have to add them up. I don't want to do that. Let's tentatively call this 30. Let's call that 50. Wait, hold on. Let's tentatively call this 60. So I meant. It's not quite 60. Let's call that 80. Call this fucking 100. Call it 110, give or take. Very close. 110 plus or minus 5. So how many do you need before... I think you need 150 before Wadabo, Warbo will acknowledge that you have a shit ton. Twenty six HP. This thing actually has a good HP growth though, I think. So I need three more Metal Kings. Which means three more King Slimes and three more Andrials. Is this right? Yeah, I think so. Do I have six Sirloins? I have four. I'll heal the Waru. Waru, Warubo is a little stealth pun, I guess. Waru means evil in Japanese. This is not where I wanted to go. God, even catching this many more fucking king slimes sounds like a chore. And I need a bunch more material enemies, but that should be really easy. Because I've got that material world. Alright. The Andreals, genders don't matter. God, I forgot about it. I forgot. I forgot. I had a level 1 just chilling with me. Those stat ups are insane. His HP growth is still kind of bad. But holy shit, the setups are insane. The genders, once for once, truly don't matter for anything I catch. Just need to catch... Whoa, I accidentally caught it and then released. Yes. I need that. 
King Slime. Need one of these King Slimes. King Slime female. Hell yeah. Did it really do nothing? I noticed that it was forcing me to re-download the entire game myself. I think that's my third Andriel. So now I just need two King Slimes. I don't want to fire weed. That would have done it. They keep on getting the first attack on me. This should possibly do it. King Slime Mail. I still have a bunch of materials. I kind of caught things in the wrong order. It was kind of stupid that it's like literally the entire game. My favorite slime is meme slime. That's the blue one. King slime, got it. Alright. I wonder how much room I still have at the farm. Because every material I catch is I'm going to have to make room. Because I'm stupid. I should have caught all the um, materials and all the andrials first, and then come back for the king slimes. I've still got a shit ton of money. I can buy the soil line I want. Did it not even add like the pretty kick and stuff though? The new Shinnok Low and all that. Because we, we still don't have that, right? That guy. Whoa, that's a great drag. I need Muse. Also, he beat me. That's a White King. I actually need that. Hornbeat. That's like an ogre, I think. Is that a, is that a Hornbeat? Hornbeat, ogre, White King. How am I dying? I know I'm like one monster. Oh, I just accidentally fucking world dude my enemies. Want to not take that much damage. That White King really resists. Why is it so tough? Ah, uh, because it's healing. I have no idea what's happening. Ah, the White King's been casting heal all. That explains everything. If I was using the Sage Rock every single turn, I would have been a lot better off.
Oh, I think I just lost. I think I can't possibly win. Whatever quad hits is generously stronger than what I had been doing. Oh shit, I won. I got a magic key for it. That was a healing guy. I should have had him heal me. Kung Fury? Kung Fury? No, it's not. But... You're not far off. Oh yeah, I need some materials. That White King would be so useful. I sh wish I'd like... I wish I had a bigger team. I save stated after I got in there. Now I know it can happen though, so like that's all I need. Whoa, that was a guy. He has a fucking gold slime. What are these? I've never seen them. <gasps> that's, um, that's the, that's Robuster too. Oh. A gold golem. I've been doing things wrong again. So I need a single... I've already got the ingredients I need. I'll just take the White King. Damn it, skills. Damn it. Got the White King. There we go. Now I need a material family. I should be able to catch like anything. So I didn't realize this, but you can just move back and forth. And that'll generate people. I was kind of hoping a coil bird would just kind of join me just like that. I'll take the healings, please. Fuck. Alright, this is way easier to grind than I realized. Alright, catch a material. God, I've got to release a monster. This is a good opportunity to look at all the things I've caught. So this needs to breed with um, an andriel. Yeah. I've got two female... I've got three female andrials. Let's get rid of that fucking shitty walrus man. Protomech is male. They all need to be male. Brush that is fine. Just try not to drop something super rare. Fucking a shitty ass female material. I can easily get a new Mad Goose, but at the same time I need a Mad Goose so it makes no sense to throw one away.
cannot have female. Cannot have female. That butterfly can't be rare. Alright, breeding time. Hardcore breeding time. I already have the White King. That's so nice. That's so convenient. I keep on forgetting that that's a thing and that, that their monster is like relatively scale tier level. What the... Um, great log. need to make a bunch of monsters right now. I could have just caught a gold slime, but... I didn't know I could do that until it was too late. So proto mech plus there's a metal drag. Do not hatch. Brush head plus and drill. Metal drag. It's always inbreeding time with this game. You actually cannot inbreed. It's actually just impossible. Because you can't keep parents. And you, you, there's no way to generate a sibling, and there's no way to have, like, different generations. I never even thought about that. You simply cannot inbreed in this game. There's my other metal drag. Alright. So, I've got... Of my king slimes, I've got female, male, and female. So I need two males and a female for the metal drags. There's a one male. There's the female. So I need one more male. Cool. That was perfect. These things level pretty fast. In fact, I think it'll take exactly one battle. Okay, I got uh, one enemy, so I think it'll take two battles. Never mind, took one battle. One battle with one enemy. We should take, like, three battles to get the one in the farm to level 10. No, probably two. Especially if that's the third one. Alright, so let's, um, go to Great Log finish up my breeding. What is it that the White King needs to breed with to make a Hargon? I've already forgotten. Metal Drac plus... Oh, it's King Slime first. King Slime plus Metal Drac. Metal King. Yes. Do not hatch. King Slime plus Metal Drag equals Metal King. Do not hatch. Metal Drag plus, no, King Slime plus. There we go. Alright, we got three Metal Kings out of that. Two of them are going to breed to be a. Did I fuck up? Again? No. I have no gold slimes. So I need one gold slime, one metal king, and one grand slime. In the grand scheme of things. Two of these need to be opposite genders. The other one needs to be the opposite gender of my... Um... Argon, I think. I mean of my... Fuck. They're all male. So one of them definitely needs to change. White King is male, so two of them need to change. This is Villa. Alright. 
We need another battle. It should take several. It should take like three or four. These things level quite slowly. Oh, one died. I have to make sure they don't die. I could have just set them to cautious so they would defend constantly, which would have been smarter than what I did, which is nothing. My main mon doesn't have any fucking... I like how Quad Hits is generously stronger than all my spells, but he still casts spells. There we go. Level 10. Now back to Great Log. This is so ridiculous, like the gameplay I've, I've found here. Uh, breed the Metal King and the Metal King for our Gold Slime. The gender, I think, does not matter. I need to breed it with a, a Stark. Oh god. I need that other Divine Gone. And I need that Duran. Pizarro? God damn it. Oh, God damn it. God damn it. Every time I think I'm making progress, I realize just how far I am. Alright. In order to make a Pizarro, I have to make a Duran plus an Astark. I mean a Divine Gone. Divine Gone is annoying to make, but not difficult. The problem is I need two. Damn it, dude. Because I need Pizarro to make an Estark. The Gold Slime needs to breed with the Estark, though. And the Metal King needs to breed with the White King. Gold Slime standard does not matter. Metal King's gender is already correct. They both have the very slow leveling system. This isn't so bad. I can breed another Duran. I can breed another Divine Gone. Just take it real slow. Pungo playing just now? Shit. I like watching Punko play. What is FFM Rumble? There's a tournament this weekend, isn't there? So these two are both level 10. I'm like completely breeding just a, just a, uh, leveling just a breed. I don't give a fuck about stats and skills anymore. White King plus Metal King equals Hargon. And Hargon needs to breed with Orochi to make a Barmos. Hargon was not super hard to make, thankfully. I think he was actually the first one I bred the first time I played this, of all the bosses. I got a White King just like playing through the game. I bred a White King somehow. And then Metal King, um... I like intentionally caught a bunch of medleys and then I like bred them. I saw this, I like looked this up. It's like White King, I have one of those. Breed it with a Metal King and uh Boom. I had a Hargon. Hargon's a little priest guy, I think. So I need to breed an Orochi. And a Duran and Divine Gone. What's Duran again? 
I can catch a Serpentius or a Serpentia. But breeding a Jamorous is insanely hard. No, it's not. What am I talking about? Gold Golem is the hardest way to go about this. Jamorous and Serpentia is actually the easiest. Okay, there's a unique way to do this that I haven't done yet. So it's actually not looking that bad. So here's my Hargon. He's a little priest guy, he's cute. I actually really like this design. This is one of my favorite bosses in the series. I think he's the last boss of Dragon War Monsters too. I like the the Draki on his little bib there. He's cute. Very cute enemy. So I need to go to first thing to find that best spot. Do I have sirloins? I need lots and lots of sirloins. I need to make sure uh, my level, my super low level is a decent. Oh god, he's here. So, oh, an onion. I need, whoa, that's a Kotal. He's a tail eater. These are all monsters from Kobe's journey, I think. A lot of them are. Not all of them. That's an Orochi. That would save me a lot of time. That would save me a lot of time. Orochi joined. What gender does it need to be? I swear to God, I'll just breed it with itself if it needs to be the other gender. It needs to breed with my Hargon. I literally just found the thing that needs to breed with the Hargon. And of course they're both male, but whatever. I can just breed. I just need a single dragon now. And that's really easy. I can just go to Sky and pick up a dragon in one second. It needs to be a female dragon. Got him. Yes, that was fast. That was really fast. I love how fast that was. I just say, that was awesome. Great log. So I'm going to breed this dragon, this Orochi with a dragon. That'll make it an Orochi as well. Uh, and it needs to be female. Still male. I can't believe the amount of work I'm putting into this game. Imagine if I put this much work into my actual job. Alright, these two are going to have sex, believe it or not. I can't believe how much time I saved. That was perfect! That was so perfect. What the fuck has all dense and sandstorm that keeps on fucking... I keep on breeding with. Alright. So now... We go to Great Log and breed these two. There we go. Uh, what is it? It is a... What the fuck is it? A Barmos. When do I need this Barmos again? I need to breed a Mudo. God fucking damn it. Are you fucking serious? This 
still need a Duran and a Divine Gone. I can cut to Divine Gone from those asshole Monster Masters. They have them. I don't know what a Gorago is. I'll worry about that sometime later. I shouldn't need the Mudo from so for some time. So I got Baramos, who I think is the last boss. No, he's like the penultimate boss of. He's the fake last boss of Dragon Warrior Monsters. I mean, Dragon Warrior Three, I think. He's got really good stats considering I've been leveling, level wanting everyone. Um. So now I can just not worry about this guy for a while. Let's go pick up Baffy and just throw this guy in the. No, I'll level him up a bit. I could drop him off, honestly. He doesn't need to be. I'll just pick up Baffy. So, if I was going to catch Divine Gone, first things first. Wait, first things first is let's get some. No, he'll just die. It'll be fine. He'll just die and it'll be fine. Hello, mister. This is the medicine guy. There's a great drac. I really want that. Um. Are emus that rare? That's a gold golem. A gold golem would still be really good. I really should have caught it. I think I've seen this guy's entire lineup. The thing that would save me the most time is that, that Robuster guy. This is three monsters that I want. It's a great drac, a gold golem, and a Robuster too. Can I really not find? Is that as good as it gets? I don't think I need an ogre for anything. Is the gold golem needed for anything else? I don't think so. I can use it to get a quick Duran. I only need a Centisar beside that. I think I do need a Duran. Yeah, I do. Alright, Gold Golem is the one to get. Three lizard men. G Bill. I just saw one. With emus. Emus are easy. Gold Golem, I got it. I still need a Divine Gone though. So now I need a Centasar, which is Gate Guard plus any beast, I think. Which should be really easy. Please be Sirloin. Rib, that's fine. Taking the long way this whole time. I don't care about your skills. I kind of care about your skills. Wow, those stat ups were incredible. So, this thing's gender doesn't matter, it just needs to be the opposite of the beast I eventually find. It 
the female beast. Foss, that's a cool name. The beautiful nature of this game in Pokemon is that you can never really be overleveled because, like, if you ever get into a new area and it seems like you're being overwhelmed, you can just catch mons in that area that are overwhelming you, and they'll be just as good when you're using them. You can just have an evolving team, but it's pointless because in this game and in Pokemon, uh, your team levels up faster than the game can get stronger than you. Well, this game's harder than Pokemon is, generously, generously harder. Pokemon, even at its hardest, was never that hard. I'm getting kind of hungry. I like massively overate at like 7 o'clock. And that was about shit, 9 hours ago. So, there's a good chance that not only not only am I done with the overeating thing, not only am I hungry again, but my stomach is like empty. What was I doing? I got distracted by myself. Oh yeah, catch a beast. Nice. I'm pretty sure there's a beast just chilling around here somewhere. Like a Tungala. There we go. Male. I need a female one. That could be a problem. They might all do that. Give me the fucking Tungala. Was I just really lucky? Tungala female. Cool. Alright, more breeding time. So I just got a Centasar. Tungala plus gate card. Oh no, Gate Guard plus Tungala. Hope I didn't misremember this. Nope, there it is, Centasar. It needs to be the opposite gender of the Mon I just stole from that guy. Gold Golem. Yeah, it's male. And the one I just caught is female. There we go. Now let's do one fight. I just got a Duran. I still need a Divine Gone, though. Everything I've just done, which wasn't that much, to be honest, um, I have to do twice, though. Because I need two Durands and two Divine Gones. Get a Centasar with a Gold Golem to get a Duran. It needs to be the opposite gender as a Divine God, right? Yeah. I don't have the Divine God yet, so I can just hatch this. I like this fucking this this. It looks. I feel like it should be more green and less gray. Also, Fedo, it's cute that you just suggested that I just woke up, because actually I've been awake for almost 24 hours. I don't sleep. I've had a pretty chill day today. I feel like I've been productive, even though that's exactly the opposite of what I've been. I feel productive when I play lots of video games. I feel like I'm wasting away doing nothing when I'm just, like, working. That sounds really stupid, doesn't it? And for more, Fire Bane, Bang, Ice Bolt. He's only missing ba uh, Blaze. I want him to have Mega Magic, so. Give me that level 10. There we go. Um. Now I need to 
catch a Divine Gone, which I might be able to do in this region. I just had a death. Deaths are fine. Oh, this guy can resurrect my dead. Cool. Alright, by merely walking back and forth between these two maps, I should be able to find someone eventually. There, like that guy. He has an Orochi. Can you use Orochis to easily get, uh, or Kotals? Can you use an Orochi or Kotal to easily get a Divine Gone, though? That's the big question. I don't actually remember how to get Divine Gone. I have a feeling that Orochi is one of the two ingredients. I was hoping to just find an uh, Orochi. I mean, a Divine Gone. But really, this isn't. This is like fine. This is like a okay. This is a good substitute. The smaller it is, the more I think it's weak. But that's not always true. Let me make sure I've got this right. What is dragon? Divine Gone is only Sky Dragon and Serpentia. That can breed a Sky Dragon, that's not even hard. They're just Dragon plus uh, Phoenix. I can find a Phoenix from these guys. The Orochi joined. get some money really fast. Now I need like m more items. I need to max out my inventory. Alright. Now I have to go to the arena and um, kick some ass and take some names. I literally don't have to do anything except hit one button. That theoretically means I could just hold. Hold on, I'm going to try this out. I could just auto-fire. It didn't work for that message. It doesn't... That message doesn't like auto-fire. Yep, I just made a lot of money. Wow, this is stupid, but it's working. I just got nearly the max amount of gold. Let's get the max amount of gold just for the shit of it. Just for the shit of it. That was that worked very well. Yup, capped out my gold. Cool. So now I'm wealthy and I have lots of sirloins. Let's go um, catch a sky dragon. Dragon plus phoenix. What are my existing dragon options? Let's go see if we can fight a phoenix from one of those guys.
the strats are real. Because I can't stop easily while holding speed, um, the best possible way to ch uh, go between maps is to go between two maps, because I won't be able to stop in like a middle map anywhere. I need to have no middles. And doing a square would be exactly as fast as doing a... Um... Wow, I'm getting pretty unlucky. Not finding an NPC anywhere. It might not be luck. Say it like that. Jewel bag is still a cool enemy. I still never fought the king squid. I could probably kick his ass. Suck all, more like suck all. I guess I'll let the starfish join. Why not? I guess I'll let the mad candle join. Why not? I can't find a single enemy. A single person. Not even one guy. I think sometimes when you go in, that's happened before. I went in and there was literally no one. I haven't saved my game in a long time. Let's see if I've ruined my save file somehow. Nope, game still saves. I've played games with like on and off cheats, tons of save stating, and then like forgotten to ever ever save the game naturally, and then tried to save the game naturally and it's like, oops, your file is corrupt. I'm like, shit. I guess it's only saving with save states from now on. God forbid there's something after, like, post-game. Man, it's like fucking you have to... The the end credits force you to go back to main menu. A lot of JRPGs do that. I love JRPG post-game, to be honest. Unfortunately, Paper Mario is one of the best JRPGs, and it has absolutely nothing related to a post-game at all. Which is a shame. There we go. Did I really just level up from fucking... Our basic enemy? My guys require so much experience to level up. Okay, this was working pretty well earlier. Kind of surprised it's not working anymore. I don't know what the variable is. I don't know the random number that makes it so people appear. But if you need at least one free inventory slot so you can take the thing that they give you, I doubt it. There's a tower I didn't even explore in this region. A wake sand? I forgot that was even an item. Yo, NPCs are no-shows right now. What if I go into a town and leave? Will that reset my NPC odds? That could be a tiny metal. I wonder if it's the money somehow. I wonder if me beating a bunch of people in the arena somehow killed them. In other worlds. I still haven't fought Terry. I don't know how to do that. I haven't figured that out yet. I might have to just beat all difficulties of uh, the arena. Goopy? Sure.
Getting all the really hard monsters is like crazy difficult, but then when you're done with it, you just have to clean up the rest of the monsters. And that's really easy. There is no one here. There is just no one in this world. I'm going to do something else instead. I'm going to go to a different world. Maybe that's what I have to do. I doubt it. I'm going to reset. I'm going to do a soft reset. That's what I think I should do. No, I'm going to do a hard reset. Monk. Hard reset is the best, safest way to reset some random number generator that's going a little wonky. Where are you, Monster Masters? I still clearly got room in my, um, Wimbies? Still clearly got room in my, my monster stable. I can't figure out what the thing is that's making it so that you can't find them anymore. Did I just find too many? And I'm done? Is that it? Sorry, region over. That shouldn't be. It seems like something I did in-game has prevented me from finding them. But the only thing I did was win a bunch of tournaments and get a lot of money. And I don't think their appearance is tied to my money. What did I need a divine gone? Let's just breed a phoenix. It's not even hard. It's a gizmo and a fucking bird. Let's look at my existing birds. I could read God. That's like that point. This thing will directly be resulting in like a super crazy mon. Direct result in a divine gun, and the divine gun will directly result in a it's Pizarro. I've got an Aqua Hawk. No, I don't want to use that. I don't want to use the Mad Goose either. Oh yeah, this thing. This guy. I forgot about him. He's my favorite. I could breed him. I like him too much. No, he's perfect, actually. I'm going to breed him. Um, So, I need a female phoenix. No. No, it's dragon. No, yeah, I need a female gizmo. That should be easy. I can only find female gizmos. Hopefully a rib will be enough to woo a gizmo onto my team. There's a gizmo. It's female. Alright. Oh, you know what? Let's just use a warp wing. Um, here we go. We're going to breed that super cool thing I bre- mm, No, I definitely don't need God. We're going to breed God. With that gizmo I just got. Shit, that's not right. Is the gizmo first? No? I thought it was bird plus gizmo. thing is a bird. Yeah, it is bird plus gizmo. Which is the, uh, that one that I tried to use doesn't work. Odd. Well, I'm going to do this. Wait, do you need a Garudian for anything? I think I bred myself into a corner with a Garudian. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Alright, 
Let's use it to breed a phoenix. Um, Elmo is fine. But it needs to be the right gender because it needs to breed with a dragon of the opposite gender. Do I have a dragon at all? I breed my dragons quite prolifically. I do. It's a Rochi. No. I cannot breed that. need a dragon that's not that. So I just got a nice female phoenix. Can I attempt to catch a male dragon? There's only one dragon for me. I already know which one I want. Male fucking 